what we got. But yeah, one. moving on. So we got Ghana. Yeah, he is forever. So Drip Season Forever is Ghana's third studio album, and it was released on the same day, January 7, 2022, through YSL. How do you guys feel about that one? Starting with Hassan, how you feel about Gunna Drip? Gonna drop the most. Um... <sighs> God. Okay. Be to, honest, reword be this, honest, be to, re- to reword this, Gunna has dropped a project that once again, you just kind of turn on and forget it's running. Mm. And that's not saying that's a bad thing. That's Gunna's thing. Like, bro, I think our, one of our first albums that we reviewed on here was Wanna. On the podcast was like Wanna. And when we dropped, when we reviewed it, it was like, uh, okay. It's no. <laughs> no, 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 no. As it progressed, mm-hmm. Wanna Deluxe came out. And bruh, you can click that junk and just be, I just went on, uh, I spent 200 on lunch. Like, and you just kind of mm-hmm. keep, and you just let it ride. Because you don't expect too much out of Gunna. Yes. I don't think that you should. There's nowhere in here that you should ever expect too much out of Gunna. Never. Like, at first, my first listen, I was like, oh, hell no. Nah. What the heck are we doing here? I felt a couple brain cells leave my mind. <laughs> and from bars from everyone that was just like oh my god what am i listening to but then i had to sit here it was like i i think i texted in the group chat i was like i think i finally found the right time to listen to this project when you're just sitting there doing nothing mm. you you literally just gotta just be like playing video games or whatever just smoking and chilling because that's all it is because gun is making a project that you just kind of click and shuffle and play you don't remember the tracks really and I think that's sometimes the thing that I get from Gunna is I forget the names of songs, but I know the songs. You don't always know that. But also the features on this project um, save the songs too. 21 Savage? Love that. 21 Savage, love that. Kodak, <laughs> Kodak and Gunna back and forth. Hilarious. How you did that? How you did that? That's, it's hilarious. I love it. Um, Gunna, I I always feel like we always get young thug throwaways on mm. Gunna projects, or like yeah. thug just be like, "Here, you can keep this song. I'll I'll keep the verse." I think there's songs on there that I'm just like, "This feels like it could have been just thug song," and he gave it to Gunna, and it's fine because you know they're working in the same camp, and you you can't fault them for that. It's dope. It, it's what it is. Um, of course, Push and P, which is now going to become a whole cultural movement Push for the rest P. for the it rest already of, is. It, for the rest of twenty twenty two. Yeah, Push and P, and of course you had to get the Trap God Future himself to certify the song. So it's just like, like you know, you listen to the song. If you listen to Push and P, it's just like. Push and pee, shit, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> like you just, it's just a braggadocious ass song, bro. Like yeah. you don't, you don't, yeah. you don't think too much of it. You just go in and you just listen to it, man. What else yeah. you gonna do? But yeah, it's a gunner project, and you gonna play it. Like I can't be mad at it. It's like, I, do I remember any of the songs all the way down? Not at all. No, <laughs> not at all. I'm not gonna remember Never. none of this. But I know it's going to be on this project, and I'm just going to be like, yeah, I think it's on that one. And shuffle or click. Hmm. That's it. Word, word. Go ahead. How Marlo. you feel about it, Marlon? I don't know if it's like the Atlanta in us. Is that every time I make one of these niggas drop, we're going to listen to it instantly. But, bro, I ain't a lot to you. It'd it be that. It'd be that. I think it'd be that a lot. Because we just, we just support these niggas without even listening. I ain't really thinking about it. But this album... It's just like what, what, what I said. It's a Gunna album, though. You're not expecting nothing at all. And and I hate to say this. I actually like Gunna. I, I fuck with this. Fuck with his aesthetic. I fuck with what what he be trying to push. It'll be much, but I, I fuck with it in general. Wonderful. But his songs, they don't change. It's like you're getting, you know, it's like you almost know, know what the beat's gonna sound like before you get to the project. Hmm. They only come in like six different variations, but bro, he's gonna need the same kind of up tempo. Low, like weird beats with like a western background like it'd be like it, it don't be complex like it'll never be complex it'll never be experimental it'll never be more than what you're getting 
And I and I can say I don't want to say that same thing for Thug, but a lot of niggas they be falling into that same loop and that same pattern, and it's not progressing anything. So like I said, I went to this project with low expectations, and like yeah, you pushing P, the cut at black song, like even even the fans talking, about, oh, pussy drop pussy, drop pussy power, bro. It, it was the it, it was literally the epitome of what I, I, I said. I do love pussy power. Though, I like it too, but bro, the beat was basic, the beat was generic, dog. It, you you could have heard. Else. Bro, the, I, bro, I know I heard Thug rap on a beat like that, bro. It just be, it just be mad generic for me. It's the fact that niggas still love Gunna when he relatively has brought nothing to the rap game. Like he'll bring some lingo, he'll bring stylistically, but he's not bringing actual like great music. It just never be that way. Like I don't know, like what much to say about it because now hold on, much to talk about. Now hold on. No, I see what he I said. Culturally. Met I don't Culturally, care. I love like, that guy. He, he gonna give you one. He gonna give you, he gonna give you three out of, out of a whole fifteen song project. Like, okay, cool. Like, I don't know, that would be like, just, just play that Like, I don't bro, know. That's a it, fair bro, critique, bro. The critique is Gunner is never giving you a start to finish full length masterpiece. It's not gonna happen. It now probably won't happen. He gonna get, he gonna get the budget. He gonna get the shit to make it look nice. But bro, it's not. And then, and like I said, the songs be enjoyable. But are you really gonna say I'm listening to you all, every single one of these bitches again? Probably not. No, you're gonna listen make, to make, them, make, but you're not gonna remember that they were on this project. Like, bro, I feel like I'll hear these out more than I actually personally will listen to it. Like, it, I don't see it happening. Like, it's not interesting to listen to. It's just boring after a while. Because I can listen to 13 other niggas that are gonna do the same beat and everything. Like, Go ahead, man. Like, and, 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 and I'm, a little short, like, that. I'm a little confused about that put, whole... Put the, put the science to this. Because it's like, how? how are you critiquing Gunna like that? It's Gunna. Because it's true. It's Why true. do you want Gunna to switch it's up and, and make some masterpiece? Want, He's not going to do that. I want, I want Gunna to make good music. Just got to throw this out here. He does have a song with Chloe in here. And I, if y'all I, don't I, know, I and I'm probably going to put a screenshot in here, I have Chloe blocked on Instagram. She don't care, uh, but I I just I, know this is just for me. Can, can can you explain it like why though? Because like that's weird. I don't know. So I already didn't follow Chloe, and um, one day Instagram automatically forced a photo upon me of her, and it was like yeah suggested, but it was like on my scrolling feed. And it was like yeah, we think that you should follow this person, and it showed like full photos, and I was like, but I don't like her. And I blocked it because I was like, "You're not about to force me to look at to try to follow and look at this girl." But very anti-black. But her on the song, I'm like, "Okay, thanks, Chloe." Yeah, yeah, I don't think that really I think hate. she can sing very well. I I'm not doubting that. I just like that Why man. Gunner said, "Well, oh, I'm gonna get this one on here for the ladies." As respected as but, I think he should. My son, that's being girlfriend. You can't hit her. Can't hit her like that. You tripping? I'm just like, what? I'm like, what's the reason? I don't like Chloe. Why? For no reason. For no reason. For no I don't reason. know my reason. It don't got to make sense. It don't got to make sense. You know my reason. It don't, it don't make sense. You know my reason, bro. She I know. I know his reason, but it don't. You really know make my sense, reason. Though. It don't really make sense. It does. It really does. Cause it's the. It's the. You knew you was about to be going this way. Yo, cause I'm so hot. Cause I'm beautiful. I'm gonna cry. Shut up. Damn. Go ahead, Ben. But um. But nah, like, yeah, that whole thing about Ghana, you know, making a masterpiece, I, I don't know where you're getting that from. Like, I don't know why. Every time we got to review uh, a trap rapper, it's this, he has to change things. Like, no, my bro, nigga, like, bro, he got his bro, lane. How, like, how, he's going to continue question, doing that. Let me ask a question. How many, mm-hmm. like, young movie projects are you going to continue to listen to if you don't sound like, like, are you going to be doing that until your I'm going like, to still listen to my young nudie. I'm not. After a while, like, at a point, if he ain't trying to like switch the shit up, I'm bored. I'm like, okay. Nudie not on the same level as Gunner. He's not. But, but, but Gunner's gonna be the same style. He's gonna be the same. Like you know the beats before you. He has a lane. Like, like, in Ben, as lane. you nah, Ben, as you review, better, can you please bring up the Freddie Gibbs line? Yeah, man. Now, this nigga that wasn't said, even that dope. With Freddie Gibbs, niggas are telling fibs. Come on, bro. He that, said that, that was supposed lame. to be the most. You know. The highlight of this man's career. Hence, yeah, hence like, come what, on, dog. Hence what I said, bro. Like, bro, this is garbage, bro. 
Like, Nobody man. needed to pull Freddie Gibbs into this. None yeah, bro, at all. If you're gonna, di- all. If you're gonna diss Freddie Gibbs, I would just say you actually try, bro. <laughs> like, damn. But um, let me get into the review though. I mean, I'm a fan of Gunner. You know, I'm a huge fan. Yeah. I like one a lot. Yeah. This album, the first song, you could have kept that off. Shit was boring. Definitely could have. You should have started it with pushing P. Pushing P is hard. I like the song after that. Uh, Poochie, whatever it's called. I hated that shit. Um, that beat was crazy. You oh, the bro, beat hard. That, <laughs> yeah, that beat was crazy, nigga. I was like, damn, who made this beat? So sad. I was like, okay. But um, yeah, Gunna is. I'm proud of Gunna because of the fact that he created his own lane, and he's sticking to it. You know, I don't need Gunna to go out do anything Ooh, different. Tomato. I don't. Tomato, I don't need him tomato, to. Tomato. Ooh, he's sticking Ooh, in his lane. He's doing what Ooh, makes him comfortable. Tomato. I'm proud of him for that. One thing I will say that he's doing really good is he's working very well with his features. Very yeah. fucking well with his features. Because he knows what his features need to do. He. Save him. I think he is very underrated with that. Because a lot of people, they get their features and it's like, yeah, your feature ain't really come through for you. You're not really doing well or your features outshining you. And he's blending in with these motherfuckers. Anytime he got a song with Future and Young Thug, it's a banger. Anytime he got a song with Future, it's a banger. The song he did with Kodak is a banger. Little he baby? just keep making bangers with these niggas. 25, now, the 25. only song that I don't like is the one with Chris Brown and Young Blue. Chris Brown, that was trash. The shit that he was doing was trash. I, I just, I don't want to die alone. Trash. I hate that. They trash. They trash one more time. Trash. Trash. But um, besides that, like I said, it was a decent project. It wasn't nothing too crazy. You know, I do like the fact that he got a little introspective this time with that song. Um, he was talking about his health issues on one of them songs. Um, oh, I know what you're talking about. Where you're talking about uh, his kidneys. Yeah. Um. Living wild, living wild. That's the song. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, that was that was cool. You know what I'm saying? He showed a little different. But besides that, it's not really too much to say about it. You know, Gunner is gonna stick to his his code. He's gonna talk about the drip or drown shit. He's gonna talk about the ice, the water. You know, that's what he's gonna talk about the diamonds and shit. So, you know, that's really about it for me. Hey P, hey P, he's out in the trash. Hey P. You'll be okay, man. On a scale of one to ten, what do y'all give the project? I can give it a seven. Give me seven. I give I give it a six. Give it a five. Okay, it's an understandable review. Marlon just shitty on this project, like he ain't about to be bumping, pushing P all week. Right. No, 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 bro. I I didn't say I would. I wasn't already doing that. I'm saying like, bro, he'll give you five songs out of a 15 song project. I told you, it just gonna be precise yeah, of the expected. album. Like the hit songs are gonna hit, right? But every the, all the fillers, even the songs he did by himself, were they really hit? No, that shit was boring. Like, like damn, I ain't asking for a lot. The trust actually try, like for real, for real, because the hype be way. Thanks for watching. Hit the subscribe button to check out more videos.